Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today's episode we're playing some more Fallout 3 and in this episode we'll be doing um, well we'll be doing a guide on how to get the unique weapon miss launcher which is a unique missile launcher and also guys um, just to let you know this is actually the first Fallout 3 video I've done in a long time because I've been busy doing Fortnite as well and I will try to do both Fortnite and Fallout 3 and also along the way will be Red Dead Redemption 2 when that game comes out, so I can't wait. So, um, yeah, so to do this you need to come here on the map to um, Fort Independence. And what you want to do is you want to go inside. Make sure this guy doesn't see you though, because I don't think they actually let you inside. But if you're lucky then you might just get in. Actually, I remember the last time they were shooting at me in here, so I don't know how I've just gotten in. But yeah, you'll find a lot of stuff like medkits and that, but what you'll really want to be aiming for is the, um, hold on. Is the bottom floor. Now on the bottom floor you'll be able to get to this um, weapon storage room and find the weapon. So at lower level and... On, and when you're there, I think you meant to p pick up a key to open up this weapon stash room. Alright, you gotta pick. I think you gotta do the terminal as well. If I'm not mistaken. Oh. Well, normally I fill these terminals, but. Alright, oh, we are door activated. So, yeah, we could just walk straight through. Okay, so I don't think it's this one, I think it's just the very bottom floor that you meant to go to. You're not involved with this. You want to keep it that way. Alright, let's go out of here and then just go down here. Said you're yeah, I don't think it's in here either, because I've never actually gotten this weapon before. So it's going to be a bit hard for me to try and explain. Back off, local. Back off. Yeah, so I think it's right in here, so you meant to go to the research terminal. And it'll have all these um, research logs of the weapon. So yeah, now I, now I think you just go straight in here. There we are, and on the side here you'll see the missile launcher weapon, and let me just drink some stuff so I can actually carry it. There we are, and you've also got some plasma rifles, some laser rifles and stuff in here. Also uh, microfusion cells if you ever need some. And also you got laser rifles as well, so if you ever see like, um, see I got my laser rifle that I can just repair so easy. And also you got some medkits in here too. Some um, other medkits that need to be unlocked. Oh, missed out one blood pad there. You also found a minigun here, but I don't really use them, so... Oh, and some alien power cells and all. So if you ever do get the, um, DLC, um, Mothership Zeta, then that will be good for all the alien weapons as well. So now that we're done here, let me just pull the weapon out, or I'll just read the stats like I always do. So as you can see, it says Miss Launcher, damage 104, weight 15, value 141, and right now you get 84 missiles with it. Oh, I think that's just how many I've racked up. I'm not sure. But let me just pull it out. Because it looks like any old missile launcher in the game. 
and I'm gonna go show you guys some gameplay of this weapon and I will see you guys after I finish doing the gameplay Okay, so I hope you guys have enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And actually, before I end this video, I just want to mention that if you're going to use this weapon, use it in VATS because without VATS, this thing just goes all over the place and it doesn't really help. But in VATS, this thing is perfect. And if you can, just try and look out and get it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you all later. Peace out.